I've got something really important to tell you. The headmaster, he's... What about him? He's an inspirational educator and he's really turned the school around. Exactly. No, you can't just leave Mum here on her own. I'm feeling much better. Well, how can you? You don't even know what's wrong with you. Look at this. Every household gets a customised Hazelbrook tablet. I thought you hated science. I thought so too. But now, thanks to Hazelbrook, I can be me. Is that the deputy head's daughter? Yes. And she's making a massive profit off the school. I'm building a robot? <laughs> you. You've never even plugged in a laptop. She could be very useful. Look into my eyes. Resistance will only bring pain. He hypnotised you. So you really believe me? It's the only explanation that makes sense. So what do we do now? We work as a team. Ethan, tell me more about your parents. <gasps> that master got to you too. He did this to you. He did this to all of us. Get out! What's going on? I don't know. That's Lizzie's house. She's probably been vandalizing again. Come on, Sophie. Thought you wanted to go in early for extra lab time. I don't think you understand how serious this is. Making nuisance calls to the police is not at all funny. No, I do understand, OK, She but... really does. I have a disability myself, and we've taught the kids all about using the emergency line appropriately. You see? Imagine your mum was very ill, and the ambulance was late because of your silly prank. It was not a prank, OK? I was trying to tell you that the headmaster, he's... He's an inspirational educator, and he's turned the school around. Lizzie. I don't understand. Why do you keep doing these things? I'm sorry. We won't take any action. This time, to make sure it doesn't happen again. It won't. I'm really sorry. I... Oh. Mary. Mum. Mary, you okay? You okay, madam? Mum? Do you want some water? How long are you just going to keep blanking me? You brought the police round to our house. You know stress makes mum worse. Well, I didn't mean to. So why did you do it then? Is he okay? Yeah. I mean, are you okay? Last night you were... I'm talking. Come on. Ethan. Where are we going? Ethan, what is with all the mystery? Shh. I found this last week. What is this? Is that safe? Just get down there. Whoa. I didn't even know this place was here. I don't think anyone does. Thought it was a good place to talk. Yeah, about what? I saw a police car outside yours. Hmm. Yeah, I tried to call the police. I tried to tell them about the headmaster. Without me? I thought we were a team. You told me to get out of your house. What? Yeah. When I asked you about your parents. My parents are pioneering anthropologists doing important work for the benefit of humanity. That is exactly what you said. And so did your auntie. Well, it's true. So what did the Fed say? Well, I couldn't tell him anything. Just kept saying the same thing. Inspirational. Really turned the school around. Exactly. 
We can't tell anyone the truth. Except each other. Most of the time. Suppose he thinks kids aren't a threat. Let's show him he's wrong. Attention, please. Take your seats. Orderly rules, please, by school year. What was that? I know. As quickly Come on, as you can. Quickly, quickly. Now then. Settle down, settle. Excellent. This week, we are taking the school science fair to the next level. You, our science and technology stars, will compete for the title of overall science superstar. It's so exciting. Sophie Johnson, you will take us through a series of chemical reactions. Leakad Prasul will be sharing his most recent findings on the properties of sound waves. Tyler Warren will be giving a practical demonstration on advanced robotics. <gasps> Normal timetables are suspended as the whole of Hazelbrook Academy prepare for this important event. Mrs. Marin invited all parents, guardians and caregivers. Their attendance is strongly recommended. Yes, Headmaster. Dismiss. <laughs> something bad in the cakes. You want to poison the parents? No, I mean chilli powder or salt instead of sugar. This is lumpy. You didn't serve your flour properly. We're never going to get it past her. Throw this away and start again. No. What? I'm done here. I need to work on my presentation. The science fair is tomorrow. Exactly. We're behind on the baking schedule. Not my problem. Why can't you do it? As brand leader, my bandwidth is jammed with analysing flow through and offering holistic solutions. You what? Obviously, none of you have any business experience, which is why I am CEO of Angelic Eats. So why should we help you make money? It's a trickle-down effect. A rising tide raises all boats. Raise this. Me. me? I'm me. Did you know? <laughs> Lizzie Warren. I might have known. He did it too, Mum. And she started it. Hmm. Sophie, Ethan, Lizzie, clean up and to the headmaster. I can't believe you did that. It's not fair. If I'm going to be a science superstar, I need all the love time I can get. Why is it so important to you? Because. Science for success. The future belongs to those who know the answers. Out of my way. I'm going in there. Mum, no. No, Mum, please. <laughs> Good morning, parent or caregiver. Don't give me that. I'm here to see your boss. Regarding what? Oh, I'm not being funny. But he's having a laugh. He's got my Blake coming in early, staying late. Mum, I want to. Now, listen to that. How can you say that's normal? Even when he's at home, there's something no right. Talking like a robot. Doing homework. No. There's something going on here. Mrs. Vinnie, it appears that we must speak yet again. What do you mean, again? You will follow me. Just to warn you, nothing you can say will change my mind. Mm. Of course you must put in the extra hours. The more the better. 
better. Oh, that headmaster is such an inspiration. I can't wait for the science fair tomorrow. He's gonna turn our families into zombies, or worse. Ethan Prendergast, the headmaster will see you now. Remember, don't look in his eyes. <clears throat> and you will be next, Lizzie. Lizzie Warren, what a surprise. I'm not looking at you. Don't be so childish. Uh, you hurt Ethan, I know you did. Ethan needed my help, just as you do. Now, look into my eyes. No! Lizzie Warren, look into my eyes. Again. Yep. What is this? What am I doing here? Keep icing. You're really finished? No. I am finished. Most hypnotic techniques require the willing collaboration of the subject. How would I hypnotize someone? Against their will? Yes. I would use sound. Sound? Yes. Obviously. Obviously. You just need a powerful speaker, a transducer, and an oscillator. Going high. Going lower. Is it still going? I can't. Sorry. What was that? Infrasound. As low and loud as we could go. I've never felt anything like that before. I have. I think you have too. So, as you see, sympathetic resonance demonstrates the ability of sound waves to affect the physical world. There are sounds at both ends of the spectrum that none of us can hear. Ultrasound and infrasound. Certain frequencies can affect the molecular structure of the brain. Working on a level deeper than consciousness. Exactly. You seriously think he hypnotizes people using sound waves? He uses his eyes mainly, but it must be a part of it. I tried not to look into his eyes earlier, but I still did. So did I. The point is, it could be a way to fight back. Yeah. If we can disrupt his sound with our own. We'll go louder and bigger. Drown him out. I like it, as soon as he starts speaking. Honestly, Mum, you're not going to miss anything. It's just a boring science fair. Robo's not boring! We know, love. Don't worry, we'll be there. It's just Tyler's robot. You can see that any time. And plus, Mum, you're not well enough to go out. You are in bed all day yesterday. Because of you! Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop this. Calm down. The both of you. I know you're trying to look after me. But Tyler's only in year seven. And he's been picked out of all the kids in school. I'm not going to miss it for the world. Phosphorus is highly reactive and we store it under the water. Phosphorus pentasulfide, however, is very different. It must not touch water. Because? It releases... a deadly... gas. You see, the properties of a chemical compound are utterly different from its component elements. I'm boring you, aren't I? What? No, 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 no. no I, I think um, it's brilliant. Re re yeah. Better than your brother? He's my main competition, you know. I wish you could both win. Thanks, Lizzie. You're welcome. All good? 
Yeah, it's all set up. The headmaster's due to speak at the end of the show. I'd better go in before they open the hall. Okay. Hi. I'm Blake, I'm one of the school's welcomers, and welcome to the Hazelbrook Academy Science Fair. Come this way, please. All parents and caregivers are welcome to the Hazelbrook Academy Science Fair. Science for success. The next eruption of Vesuvius will commence. <laughs> Would the marvelous molecules display team wow. please proceed to the That is amazing. I don't think I understand any of it. Exactly. What a school. Heavenly muffin. Oh, do the proceeds go to charity? The profits are plowed back into Angela Keats, a business model with baked in growability. I'll have one, thank you very much. Welcome, parents and guardians. Afternoon, you have had a small taste of what Hazelbrook has to offer in the fields of science and technology. And now we present to you the work of our very best students, our scientific superstars. <laughs> and first on our scientific cavalcade, experiment on time. And now, Tyler Warren. Woo You're Tyler! Hi, I'm Tyler. I'm Robot, operated by Open Source Technology. Acronym Robot. Robo, for short. <laughs> Robo's eyes are cameras. Robo, I want you to calculate the number of different combinations that this cube can make. Calculating. <laughs> 43 trillion, 252 quadrillion, 3 trillion, 274 trillion. Whoa, Robo, that's enough numbers for one You're day. You're welcome. But it's not all work. Robo loves to have fun too. Cue music. I like the movie. Come on, Robo. I knew they would. But I love you too. I mean, you're a genius. How cool is that? Time to start setting up, Sophie. Yes, Headmaster. Ladies and gentlemen, Tyler and Robo. Thank you, everybody. And now to the world of chemistry and our eighth student, Sophie Johnson. To be there. It has to be there. Ladies and gentlemen, your headmaster. You're about to witness a display of unusual expertise in the discipline of chemistry. First, I wish to talk about my important plans for the school. The school is more than its teachers, more than its students. The school is a community, a community that includes every one of you. But a community must have a leader, which is why I must ask you to look oh. into my...
sulfite. Get everyone out now. Ladies and gentlemen, if you could please leave in an orderly manner. We're gonna die, guys! Come back, come back. Come back, come back. Some way, didn't you? To ruin my experiment. Did you plan this together? I thought you were my friend. No, Sophie, wait. May I have your attention, please? Once again, Hazelbrook has been targeted by a foolish prank. A prank? Which could have had deadly consequences were it not for the headmaster's quick thinking and heroism. Well, who did it? They should be chucked out. Yeah. 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 Hazel Brook does not exclude we improve. The culprits will be dealt with and rehabilitated. There will be no repetition of this incident. Well, how do you know that? Because it's the grand finale of our science fair, I plan to announce a new cutting-edge safety initiative. Sophie, wait. Please, just listen. I can't believe I trust you two. Were you trying to help your brother or just jealous? Neither. These new safety measures are unusually advanced, but we will stop at nothing to protect our most precious resource, your children. System initiated. All units standing by. Seriously, do you think the headmaster is a hypnotist? Yes. yes. How do you think you suddenly became so good at science? I'm a late developer, like Einstein. Yeah, when did this development start? When the headmaster arrived. He's an inspirational educator who's really turned the school around. No, he's not. He's a con man. Activity detected. Scanning. Oh. Analyzing biometric data. Master hypnotized us. All of us. I should have realized. How could I be a super brain? Me. You are clever, that's why we need you. We don't know how he does it, so you can help us. Why would I want to do that? So we can stop him. Stop the man who made me a genius. A fake genius. Does it matter? Yeah. Of course it does. I never minded being thick because I didn't have a choice. But now you're telling me I do? Why would I want to change anything? It's just really necessary. Hey, you saw what just happened. We need to keep our kids safe. Which in your case means protecting your daughter from herself. Are you sure this is legal? Letters of agreement have been sent to all Hazelbrook tablets. If you approve, please sign. Authorization received. I don't know. 
think it's no, wait, we should think about this. Oh, it's for the kids. I'm going to see them. Mary, Mary, it's okay. Mum, you're all right. Can we get some help, please? Some water. Mum, you're all right. Can we get some help, please? Ethan. What's happening? What are they? Probably doesn't need one help. Return to school immediately.